Everyone in television knows that good programming is the key to any channel's success. But with more and more channels competing for the same viewer, you also need a unique way of making your channel stand out, what we call a brand identity. By helping you stand out, this brand identity will have a significant effect on your business. Disney is one of the world's biggest and most powerful brands. When Disney decided to extend their Disney Channel franchise to the UK, they recognized the need to take account of cultural differences outside the United States. The task was to customize this well-known brand for television viewers in the UK and elsewhere. The solution was simple, yet devastatingly effective. Following the success of this brand identity in the UK, Disney are now able to proceed with their plan to utilize it in other TV territories around the globe. Arte is a European cultural channel broadcasting in French and German. However, the channel was perceived as cold, elitist and lacking in fun. What's more, its visual identity was confused and inconsistent, on screen and off. So while Arte revitalized its schedule, Lambi Nan developed a new brand identity to help change perceptions of the channel, beginning by simply tidying up the existing logo. Lambinen went on to help relaunch Arte with a completely consistent and coordinated brand identity, on time and on budget. BBC Two is the second channel for BBC television in the United Kingdom. It has a high quality mix of culture, current affairs, award-winning documentaries and innovative entertainment for the intelligent viewer. The problem was that the audience perceived the channel as being worthy, but dull. Lambinan's brand identity completely reversed these negative perceptions of the channel. It was a long-term creative property, specifically designed to be continually updated to reflect the diversity of the channel's output. Now, many of the new idents are produced by the BBC themselves. The BBC Two identity has been universally acclaimed by the television industry, building morale and motivating BBC staff. Best of all, four years on, at a time when UK terrestrial television is facing increasing competition from the new media, BBC Two is the only channel to increase both its market share and average hours of viewing. Orange is a pay television channel in New Zealand, providing general entertainment. The trouble is, at least three other channels already provide very good general entertainment, with budgets to match. So Orange was a Me Too product, launching into a crowded market. The only way to stand out in this crowd was to adopt a radical approach.
Within six weeks of its launch, awareness far exceeded all expectations. creative solutions are many and varied, but they all have one thing in common. They're all unique ways of making television channels stand out from their competition. To find out how to differentiate your channel, talk to Lambie Nan.